If there's a bright spot after this earthquake, it's the kindness of strangers. Moroccans donating truckloads of clothes and other basics to survivors. Fatma El Makra and her family are among those survivors. Like many others, they lost everything. She says about 20 people died in her village, including a neighbor hit by a rock as he tried to save his wife. When the disaster happened, we left everything behind and ran for our lives. Driving here is frightening. Steep cliffs, rock slides potentially triggered by aftershocks. One reason why aid was slow to get here. Now some international rescue workers are leaving. We have tried to work with the dogs to search for living persons. And so far we haven't found anyone. Many still alive are now homeless, like the family of Naima Azmil, who are having tea this morning. We have food, clothes and shelter, but living day by day, we don't know about the future. That's a feeling here shared by many. Lisa Bryant for VOA News, Emin Sili, Morocco.